I just took a two over Kevin. Um, obviously. Is it Kevin or Kevin? Kevin. Like Kevin. Oh well, I've, I've been I've been saying I've been saying Kevin the entire night, so now I feel like an idiot. <laughs> it's all good. Kevin's the Mario boy. But all right, we're in the set. Oh, what the heck was that? Okay. Yeah, that's what happens. You get down aired into into forward air for auto reticling in the wrong direction. That's what you get. Yo, double fair dash attack. Gotta love it. You auto reticled in the wrong neighborhood. Yeah, don't auto reticle my neighborhood. Ling Ling is. Oh, I really like the way that he spaced that second fair crossing up Hydra's shield. It looked so ambiguous. Like I could not have told like at all until after we hit that he was going to oh, go through the cross up fair. Such a good call out on the teleport as well, and that's coverage. He was like tech roll, you get bared, and I still cover with down smash if you don't tech roll. There was so little that Hydro could do though. Like like the fact that Ling Ling just floated the Hydro up now. Like honestly, the, he was had he was forced to recover the teleport. Predictable. I I like how much. Uh... Hydra swing. Normally, you see a lot of Palos. I like. I I'm a hundred percent sure you could play this character super lame on Wi-Fi. Um, but he's actually like he's 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 holding forward. It rolls right into Hydra and is able to connect the down smash. That's definitely an interesting option. Uh, not one that I would expect normally, but that's going to be the explosive flame. Not enough to take the stock. See, that's more what I expect for like Palo online. Not like like the explosive flame wall, not the I'm gonna run it and fair you for no reason. In fact, they're gonna take it though. Yo, really smart catching the DI and knowing that uh, nailed because it starts from below Palu. Mm -hmm. This goes immediately through the upper there. And just like that, Hydro has managed to bring this all the way back, keeping Ling Ling in the corner. Oh, such God. a hard. I mean, Ling Ling surely could have been back. What? My man, my man saw the future. He was literally like, "You're gonna roll in five seconds from now." Here, I'm gonna charge stuff smash. And this is like multiple times that we've seen Ling Ling roll in and get caught by like a fully charged uh, smash attack. Like this is something that we've seen in the NY Clover set um, as yeah. well. But catching that, the teleport with the fade. That uh, I don't think he teleported. I think I saw the beginning of an explosive plan. I'm pretty sure he tried to explosive. Huh. Plan. Like close to close thing, which would have hit. It just didn't come out fast enough. And really good on Ling Ling to be able to time his tech though. That connected. Uh, that was sick. Able to connect the back hill. He was looking to set up a tech chase on the platform, um, and maybe land a hit with the F smash, which would have been really, really good for Ling Ling. But uh, a little too much knockback though. Good job of calling out these jumps with these rising neutral eggs. Oh, Palu is tall as hell. That shouldn't have hit anybody. I wouldn't have got punished by that. Pika short. Yeah, this is actually still anybody's game. Like, a solid hit from Hydra will still take the stock. Oh, that was so greedy. Tell oh, that was greedy too. What the heck? <laughs> we just, we just up smashing. Yeah, he, he literally teleported on top. Yeah, sadly, I do not know these players at all. Yeah. Alright, here we go. Yeah, Hydra able to get the platform extension on Yoshi's though. Already dealing 47%, keeping Ling Ling in the corner. And I'm so surprised that none of the hits of down it. Uh, actually connected, Hadro's drift was impeccable. Slightly drifting back to just to be able to avoid it and space his nail really, really well. Nice teleport cancel back air. Just a really quick way to throw out an attack from that distance. Able to get the down tilt back air, but not going to take the stock quite yet. That yeah, down throw back there only works on DIA and shouldn't be getting hit by that anymore. It's 2020. Go with the poop. Yeah, 2020. Stop getting hit by down throw back there. 
Multi jab is only going to kill at a higher percent. Even though Palutena's multi jab does kill, but oh. is able to finally get the down tilt into the back hit. And I feel like on a stage like Yoshi's and Lilat, it's a little bit easier for Palutena to get the um, the down tilts uh, at Legend. Yeah. It's just generally easier for the two flaming moves to uh, hit just below the Legend going on the way up. Oh, oh I was just gonna say that. I, I was waiting, like, uh, Ling Ling, at, out of disadvantage, like, being put off stage, has been down airing, stalling a lot out there. I was wondering if Hydra's gonna start changing up his explosive flame distance to, like, mm -hmm. try to catch the, uh, the delay. Like, you know he's gonna delay, you know he's not rushing stage. Let me put this a little for it. Like, let me walk to ledge and put it as far out as it can go, because he's delaying out there. There's a really good adaptation on his part, though. I'm not sure what attack that was, I missed that for the second. Even the falling nail is going to be able to kill it. Ling Ling is barely holding on. So confident that he would be able to drift him unscathed that he doesn't even float. He just goes past it and is able to finally bring this to two and two stocks uh, against Hydra. Right now, Ling Ling has a turnip on hand. He has a combo able to get the full execution of it. Yeah. Though it's finally able to oh, get a little close, something on. Close the flame took it. Mm hmm. I think it's good on Hydra to like not eat the turnip on shield because he was getting hit uh, last game by like turnip turnip into grab on shield. Yeah, so, the extended shield stun just gives Ling Ling um, a bigger window just to be able to run in and uh, grab mm -hmm. But instead, that time he got to like he just nared it, caught the turnip, and then immediately threw it back at him. Uh, they're gonna put him off stage. Oh, I thought he was so gonna be honest. Yeah, Ling Ling positioned himself in a way that. He um, had you to go a little bit farther, and then had you land in front of his face, and he was like, oops, I was not anticipating this. Actually getting the stage spike with the down air, and I think that was still tackable. So, I think, uh, that was just an unfortunate early stock loss on Hydra's part. Two back is Ling Ling doesn't have his jump. What? Huh? What? Can you explain what I just looked at? The double up smash, because it's a little laggy, and it's like, if you press a button, you'll get hit. Yeah. That's the Wi-Fi strats if I've ever seen it. Ling Ling finally starting to be able to pile on a little bit of damage for himself. 140%. Hydra is looking for those two frame down tilts, stalling really, really well with his double jump, but he's going to yeah. get up attack right onto his shield. But every Palutena knows this. Everybody with a good back feel knows this. Somebody get up a taxi shield like that. That's she just exploits bad habits. It's like, oh, you like to do this option off ledge? Oh, you like to come back above ledge? See ya. This game is taking an awfully long time to load. What is going on? Yeah. It's that last round too. One, go! Right, gonna be going to game. Of Haju and Ling Ling 1 1 for each of them. And whoever wins this game moves on to winner's finals. I'm seeing a little bit of lag on my end, and uh, actually at Xeno last night, um, some people did complain about uh, lag on Ling Ling's end. So it is, it is possible Ling Ling might be having some connectivity issues. Yeah, I think it might be Connecticut in general. We actually, I mean, Ling Ling is not nearly as bad, but the reason why Blank isn't in this tournament right now is last week he had a very poor connection in the tournament. Yeah. Really nice, uh, just crossing up um, Hydra's like, drift at every opportunity he could, making the use out of his float. That's going to be the back throw. Unfortunately, the edge to be able to secure the kill there. Really, really nice timing, making sure he's not going to get hit by the down tilt. But going back onto the stage too aggressively, and Hydra was ready with that back air, and only 8% to his name. Yeah, no, that was a very, very like convincing stock. And Hydra's piling on damage now. He's gonna get punished for that. Down tilt's gonna be big stuff. Mm -hmm. I love the sounds turn it makes when they get a hit. <laughs> You know what sounds good? The PK fire connects to somebody. No, please stop. That's, 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 that's torture. 
That sounds fantastic. I like the idea. He was like, if you neutral get up and I flip past you, um, the turn of the Z drop is going to hit and I'll get a uh, fair off of it. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh wow, and actually getting the stage spike, and that's going to be the stock. Ling Ling cleaning it up in a rather unconventional way, but I guess he just has to hold that. Really, really fishing through that down tilt there. Ling Ling has, like, done like the same like timing mixed up the same stall multiple times i would like to see um i would like to see maybe hydra try to try to like try to mix it up and run off nail him for it or, or yeah especially when he it. goes that low like if he gets hit by anything he's not recovering because like I don't, know about right into that. Jesus. I don't know about run off there so much as like dare or bear yeah like nair's gonna send him up so if you hit he'll live Unless he's like super high percent. But yeah. any of the other two, when he's like exhausted his fall down there, he'll die. Mm -hmm. Like, but even if actually able to take there. out the stuff. Right now, Hydra is up. And not able to punish that. Side B is relatively safe on shield. Um, this is gonna set up. Basically, when, when Peach hits your shield with side B, it's gonna basically create like a 50 50 for either way. It just gonna be yeah. basically back to neutral. That was so weird. That was the like max distance not on the floor side B, so it auto canceled. So we got the jab out of side B. It's so strange. The specials auto cancel like like a yeah. certain amount of base landing lag. It doesn't. Well, no, 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 no. He he, we fall that. Right? Jab. I can't tell actually. I think it was jab. But I know there's there's a there's a timing on on side B that like you can hit buttons right out of it. Mm -hmm. Oh, really that was so move. good. That was so smart. Yeah, leaving a little bit of a mountain to be able to come back from this is what I would say. Did you see that tune of covering the tech roll out? That was beautiful. How did he bring this back? Use the stock down. Even. It's even. It's even. What's going on? How did... Dash tech up air? Uh, oh, uh, up smash, dude. Again, so I see Hydra coming into these up smashes so often. I don't even think the up smash would have killed Peach at that point either. Dude, if I was Ling Ling at this point, like, knowing that Hydra is, like, hot on the trigger, I wouldn't even, like, do anything. Oh, my oh, God. The dot eyes. The dot eyes. The dot eye kill screen. Dude, that angle was...